As we gear up for the Winter Olympics, it's only a couple days away. One of our very own is getting ready for a very special arrival. It's only fitting that NBC5's Caitlin Napoleone is counting down to both the Olympics and her due date at the same time. NBC5's Brianna Borgi has that story. Sometimes there's only one way to describe the timing of life's big moments. Um, unique. <laughs> On Friday, NBC5's Caitlin Napoleone is expecting her first child with husband Leif Nordgren. Also on Friday, Leif will be going for gold at the Winter Olympics in Beijing. I'm definitely excited to go to China and race, but yeah, on this, at the same time, I'm, I'm even more excited, I think, to kind of get the Olympics over with and uh, finally go home and, and kind of meet the new little one. With a dad who's competing at his third Olympics in biathlon and a mom who's been skiing right up until her due date, there's no doubt this baby will be a force of nature. Probably by the age of three or four will be a better skier than me, I imagine, <laughs> if, if Leaf has anything to do with it. Preparing for a first child is hard enough, let alone when your husband is on the other side of the world. I, of course, want him to be there for the delivery and it's a process that takes a team but I have to think of him too, you know, he's missing it as well. So we're both sacrificing a lot for this, uh, for not only for the baby, but for the Olympics as well. 12 years of my life, like going after this, you know, athletic dream, but, but the, whole, the whole family and baby thing really puts everything into perspective. While Friday's opening ceremony may have more fanfare, it's in the delivery room where the couple's life will change. And Caitlin hopes Leaf answers the phone when the time comes. She's been getting the nursery set up. I have so many diapers. Mom's, mom's oh. like, she's like, you overstuffed the drawer with diapers. I was like, I was excited. <laughs> and although the gender will be a surprise, she does want one thing figured out in advance. My goal was to have like a set girl and a set boy. Like I want the baby to be named. Like I don't want to be sitting in the hospital like with Leaf across the world, us trying to go back and forth about this. And no matter what happens at the Olympics, the soon to be parents will be bringing home the most important title yet. Baby number one. We're excited. In Heinsburg, Brianna Borgi, NBC5 News.